Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing all super well today. Uh, this video is a second part of my previous fashion haul and we are going to talk about transitional and winter pieces. At the end of the video I'm going to try them on and style them for you. So if you are interested, please keep watching. The same like the previous video, I'm going to divide it into categories of tops bottoms, suits and shoes. Now we start with the tops, obviously for winter jumpers, cardigans. So first of the jumpers is from Isabel Maran, this great jumper. And you know, I am not that much into black or gray. However, this one is perfect match for one of the suits that I'm going to show you later. And I really like it. Now, I purchased these in two sizes, size French 36 and 38. The 36 uh, was still good because that's my regular Isabel Maran size. However, I do prefer a little bit longer sleeves for winter. I don't know, it's just my thing. So I went with size 38. There was not a huge difference between the sizes. So you will see how it fits. I really like the exaggerated shoulders. And uh, yeah, I think with 38, it does fit a little bit better. Anyhow, that's my first piece. Love it. Second piece is again from a new designer that I've never purchased before. And it's Rosy Azulin. Please don't hold me onto the pronunciation. You know that I messed it up. So... Don't laugh. It is this jumper, guys, and I really love it. It is called Thousands in One Ways Sweater. And the reason why is because it can be worn in so many ways. And I love it about the sweater. Anyhow, in try on, I will show you how many ways you can wear it. Love, love it. She came up with the same sweater in different colors as well. I love the little bit light yellow. It was so beautiful. So I've got my eyes on it and hopefully I can get it. And it comes in red. I saw gray as well. Uh, this season it came as well like a fuchsia, but it had the buttons here. I wasn't a big fan. And striped one. That's interesting too. I purchased it in my regular size small and it fits great. Next one is from another new designer, Love Sack Fancy. And it's this cardigan, very simple. It's cropped, so definitely it has to be worn with high waisted denim. Like it. Again, it's my regular size small. It is a little bit lighter than the other one, so it is for like a little bit cooler nights, but not that cold. So something transition, uh, love it guys. And I got a few other pieces from this brand. The next piece I'm really excited guys is this piece from Prada. And if you watch my previous Prada video, and I will link it here, I purchased this Prada white shirt from Prada with cutouts. And I really wanted these jumpers. So I obviously hunt it down and I got this jumper with this cutout. So it exactly lines up with the cutouts of the shirt. Oops. So they are here and they are at the shoulder. Guys, I love this jumper. Even so, like beige usually washes me out, but I think with the shirt underneath and like blazer on top, it will still look cool or you know, you can put dress on it, whatever. It's a um, really nice piece. It's a uh, cashmere, so it's really nice and cozy. I ordered it in my regular size Italian 40 and it fits like love. So I can't wait to wear it. Love this piece. One more piece from Tops is this top from Magda Butrin. And it's this body. Guys, love it. It's wool. It's very, very warm. It is in uh, French size 36. Now, you know, I'm not a big fan of bodies. So what I want to do with this is to take it to my tailor and cut this piece off. So I can wear it actually as a top, even so it will be a little bit cropped because it is quite high cut here. But I will be wearing it with high waisted pants. So I think it will be fine. I can't wait to get it altered it actually and to wear it because bodies just somehow annoy me. I don't like wearing them. So I can't wait to alter this piece. So guys, next category is category of tracksuits. I was never a girl who would travel in a tracksuit, who would go out in a tracksuit. It just wasn't my thing. 
Good on you guys if you can rock tracksuits, but it wasn't me. Last year has obviously changed my life too and not many people were around so I became a little bit lazy, yes I admit it and the coffee shop that I go to is just across the road so in the morning I have to have my coffee from the coffee shop so yes I went with my tracksuit and yes it is very comfortable so I start using them more than I did before and yes I purchased now this tracksuit from Pangaya Pangaya was so highly publicized everywhere on social media so already that put me off purchasing the item when I see it all over the social media but now they came out with this beautiful sakura pink so I couldn't resist so here we go this is the hoodie and can you see just a little logo at the back and obviously they have the writing the technology that they use guys as you know they are not too expensive they are not too cheap these are the track pants uh, you can choose different styles obviously I love it uh, hinge at the bottom now I was very surprised for so much publicized item on social media this is so beautiful and guys I'm not doing any advertising it really lift up to my expectations it is really high quality love it so much i bought the cotton one but they are still like thick really beautiful on feel and um, yeah i fall in love so much they arrived this week and i already ordered another couple ones different colors obviously one the heavy weight and one another cotton one so i want to see the heavy weight because i'm not sure how heavy it's gonna to be because this is quite thick but i am so excited that i purchased them because mm, maybe in this i'm going to travel even i don't know but really love the quality guys there is so much review about the brand about the products on youtube so i'm not going to go into the depth but obviously i'm really happy to invest in the pieces in a company that uh, does try to save the environment and if each of us would do a little bit for the environment maybe this would be a better place to live in according to the size chart i should be size xxs however I've never purchased double XS size for me, so I went with XS. I thought it's a nice compromise between my regular size S in every brand and double XS. Anyhow, it fits me perfectly. So I would say size down one size if you want the regular fit or track suit. If you want the really oversized, oversized look that is so popular now, definitely go with your regular size. So that's my recommendation but really the reviews are on youtube so you can go according to that i've got few pieces from lovesack fancy as well because as you saw the cardigan pink color i went on the website and saw a few pieces that i fall in love with this sort of tracksuit is for obviously for home guys it's very heavy for winter and very warm very cozy these are the pants and again super cute in this color that i love look at the detailing i mean it's so beautiful i mean i love little hearts i don't think i will ever go out with these pants but i really love it i'm pretty sure a lot of girls can pull it off i don't think i'm one of them but i'm really excited to have something nice cozy at home and beautiful so this is the cardigan and look this cardigan i'm pretty sure i can pull off outside with high-waisted denim it is such a beautiful and cozy thing to wear i went with my regular size small in pants and top and also i purchased matching because this cardigan is cropped so I wanted something longer just in case because I'm freezing all the time. So <laughs> I thought I will get another matching cardigan look with this because they styled it on the website also with this and it looks really cute as well. And this is longer. So if you are cold, you will be not that cold. Now this can be worn off the shoulder as well or off one shoulder and it looks really cool. Now we are going into bottoms. I have scored a couple denim 
that I'm excited about. First denim is from Acne Studio. I showed you in previous video, Acne Suit. So when I went to the store, purchased them, the sales associates who are such nice people. I mean, sales associate in Sydney stores in Acne Studio, guys, you are so sweet. If you are watching, guys, I don't know if I've ever met any sweeter people, but yes, it's a pleasure shopping there and buying of you guys. Anyhow, one of them, and it was a guy, had these jeans on and I really fall in love with them. But they are not from the female sections. They are called unisex. So I really fall in love with the wash, especially for winter because I love the dark wash, but the wash is beautiful. They're very high-waisted guys, down straight. And I love the feet, they're 100% cotton. I went with the European size 29, the length is 32. I love it. Female denim did not fit me well in Acne Studio, so I never purchased denim uh, from female section. Uh, I would wear, I think, uh, size 27 or 28. I'm not sure. I, I think I tried some, but I can't remember the size, so I'm sorry. But yeah, these are 29. Now, Another denim, guys, is my favorite designer currently is Magda Butrim and this is not everyone's cup of tea. They are very, very baggy, as you can see, and hinge at the bottom and I really wanted the dark denim for winter. Now, I have ordered these at the end of last year and they were in a lighter wash. I was not a big fan of them. However, in this darker wash, they do exactly what I wanted them to do, look cool. So, obviously you have to wear the crop tops or very tight tops on the top. But I styled it with a hoodie and a size blazer and look cool. So, I will show you both ways how you can style this funny piece. <laughs> because it's not for everyone. And Magda Boutrim pieces are in French size 36. One more piece from bottom is from Balmain. Now, when I purchased these pants, they were last piece and they were in French size 36. I'm always Balmain 38, never had anything in 36, but I thought they're stretchy, maybe I will fit in, I don't know. So I haven't lost weight or anything, but they feel like a glove. So I'm really happy I tried them on. They are these super high waisted leather pants. Guys, they fit like a glove. So beautiful. The leather is super soft but still thick, like quality leather. And I love that they finish at the bottom. I don't know how to explain it like this because that's what is fashionable now. And they've got even a zipper so you can pull it even over the boots if you want to. So love it love the feet love the high love the leather oh my god really excited about this piece now we go into the category of suits and i'm really excited about these winter pieces because oh can't wait to wear them so please weather cool down now <laughs> i have to start with magda Butrin because i just really love her pieces they are such a high quality so well made and they fit i don't know for my body shape it fits great this is a suit these are the pants obviously when you see the color you know why i bought the jumper in gray and the other body in gray and they are hinged at the bottom and they are baggy obviously and super high waisty and this is the blazer guys i love it like it's a single pressy but you can really hinge it in a waist or undo it and then it will be like straight cut guys it is wool and it is so nice and warm but so comfortable love it very much the next magda Butrim suit guys and this is so in now hands tooth print as you can see very high waisted pants they are very skinny the great thing is about them that they have a zipper at the bottom so you can undo them and do them over your boots which looks really cool and really really oversized blazer guys this blazer is really oversized but it's double breasted and it really looks cool when you close it and put a thick belt 
around your waist. It looks really cool. So anyhow, you will see in styling, even unbutton it, button it up, and uh, can't wait to wear it. Comes to it, a print will be always fashionable, doesn't matter what. I think it's such a classic in a wardrobe. It never goes out of style. We go now to Acne. Acne studio, guys, and for somebody who doesn't like black and gray, I've done really well this shopping haul. I bought Again, it reminded me of Bagda, maybe that's why I bought it, because the pants are pretty much like the dark grey. So this is very, very dark grey, it really looks like black. Uh, very high-waisted pants, cinch at the bottom, it is also nice and warm and really nice quality. And this is the blazer, so hinge in the waist, single breasted, and I really like the detail on the sleeves very simple but it looks really cool uh, it is in size 36 you know this that i don't feel well i do not want to dress up or down i always opt for black or dark color and that's just me so this will be for one of those days in my previous video i was talking a lot about Attico. i purchased a couple blazers from them and uh, i love them so much so i was always talking the website for the same sort of cut and I came across oh, this color. Look at this. It's beautiful, beautiful red color and really amazing quality. This is very lightweighted wool, but it feels really good. So for winter, it will be great. Or especially transitional period, it will be a really great piece. And I think it will be really nice, you know, when I do wear black, just to put the blazer over it and you bring some color. In the outfit i also purchased the skirt now the attico usually have extremely short skirts and shorts so yeah i ordered several pieces and i always return them however this piece uh it was the last piece so i had to go with the italian size 42 in this piece however i have to take it in it's quite like it's big, obviously. And this is in Italian size 40 and in Attico I am 40. So this will be taken in. Uh, it arrived this week, so I didn't get chance, but I don't know, maybe because it's uh, 42, it is a little bit longer, but it looked a little bit longer even on the website. So I'm quite happy with it. Uh, it is a simple skirt, so I need to just take it in from the side, so it will be fine. It is wool, guys, it's so nice material. I can't wait to wear it. I don't wear too much red, but this red is so beautiful and vibrant color, so I'm excited about this suit. One piece in category of blazers is, again, this blazer from Magda Trim. look at this. It's leather, love, love, love it. Um, size 36. Guys, um, I think there are a few pieces left. Um, hurry up because they are sold out so quickly obviously it's oversized uh, style love this piece it's such a beautiful leather and i think even with the balmain leggings it will look really cool i can't wait to style it for you and show you actually how it looks one more blazer from acne and you would have seen it in my previous video is uh, this uh, blazer from wool as well and i scored it in one of the acne cells and i love it the color is so unusual it's like an orangey brick color love it it cinch in a waist and look at the sleeves i mean it does give you such a great body shape. I love it. So all my items, even in Acne Studio, are all in French size 36. Now, category of coats, guys. I've got one piece that I scored and I'm really excited about this. So this Magda Butrin coat, guys. Uh, love, love the style, guys. So it's oversized, obviously, as you can see on the shoulders. It is in my regular size 36 hinge in a way it does give such a beautiful shape to your body it's unreal love 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 this now last category of shoes guys i've got only one pair of shoes i've got plenty of boots and for sydney really you don't use too much uh, boots in winter it is from ula johnson never purchased from her before shoes i mean and you know how i love love her pants so i thought i will give it a go now why i was attracted to this boot so much is 
because of this khaki color and it exactly matches the Attico blazer that I showed you in the last video love it so much so they were final sale so I was really worried because I wasn't sure about my size anyhow I read that they are made in uh, Brazil and all shoes made in Brazil I usually have at home in size 38 so I went with size 38 and they fit perfectly so usually I am 37 and a half but boots I do tend to take in 38 but I do have some in 37 and a half so it's hard my regular size is 37 and a half so guys love the boots and I can't wait to wear them and style them for you in this first outfit I have combined Isabel Maran jumper in French size 38 with Magda Boutrim pants from the suit uh, in French size 36. Grey color is beautiful with any pastel color, so I have matched it with LK Bennett uh, heels in a light blue color. Here I have a style the Prada beige jumper in Italian size 40 with Prada white shirt as well as Prada dress in black color. For casual look, I have matched it with a Chanel combat boots in black color as well as Bottega Veneta Judy bag in kiwi color. In this outfit, I have combined a lovesick fancy jumper in small size with Acne Studio denim from the unisex section in size 29. Uh, for pop of color, I have opted uh, rag and bone uh, boots in this beautiful pink color, as well as Bottega Veneta Jody in pink color. In this outfit, I have combined Rosé Azulin jumper in small size in cream color with Magda Boutrin denim in French size 36. Since it's cream color and denim, uh, you can accessorize this outfit with any color of shoes and bag. I have opted for neutral color brown, so I have styled it with uh, Louis Vuitton Petit Mal as well as boots from Rack and Bone. As I have told you in the video, this jumper can be worn a few different ways. This is the second way how it can be worn. Please keep in mind it is all one piece so it can be separated. we have a proof that I can wear full black outfit. Here I have combined the Balmain pants in French size 36 with Magda Boutrim blazer in French size 36. I have added simple black turtleneck as well as black boots and uh, I accessorized it with Chanel extra mini cocoa handle. And here you have a close-up look on Balmain leather pants in French size 36. This Magda Boutrim suit is in French size 36. It is in a beautiful light grey color. Since it is in grey color, you can accessorize it with any uh, pastel color. I have opted for light blue, so blue Chloe bag with a blue LK Bennett heels. Here you have a closer look on the pants, which are super high-waisted and very comfortable. To achieve monochrome look, I have styled the Magda Boudrin suit uh, with the body in French size 36. Here we have 
have another of Magda Butrin suits uh, in this houndstooth uh, print that it's such a classic both in French size 36. Uh, I try to achieve monochrome look that it's so uh, in right now. So I have combined a Dolce Gabbana black and white bag as well as Jimmy Choo high heels in black and white. Here is the outfit updated with a belt from Magda Butrin in black leather. Obviously the whole look can be changed with adding any color to the outfit as black and white goes with really nearly every single color. This dark grey suit is from Acne, um, blazer and pants in franchise 36. Since grey goes with any pastel colour, I have chosen pink. So simple turtleneck in pink with Jumi Choo in pink as well as Chanel handbag in iridescent pink. Here is the close-up look on the pants from the suit. They are super high-waisted and cinch at the bottom. This suit is from Attico, the blazer is in Italian size 40, the skirt unfortunately was last piece in IT size 42, so it will be taken in. Since it's a red color, I love to combine it with black and white, so I have opted for white top from Kate, Balenciaga Navy heels in black and Chanel Classic in black. Here I have styled Magda Boudrim blazer in French size 36 with uh, black leather shorts and uh, black Balenciaga nine heels with uh, Chanel Extra Mini Coco handle. I have added a cream color top from Kate. Obviously you can update this look with her any color top or bag or shoes. One more blazer from Acne is in this beautiful rustic color in French size 36. It is 100% wool, so nice and warm. I have styled this blazer with Ola Johnson leather pants in the same colorway, as well as Scanlon Theodore singlet in the same color. For the colder days, I have updated this look with Acne Studio sweater in the same color as the blazer. I finished the whole look with rag and bone boots as well as Louis Vuitton a Keynes handbag. This Magda Boudrin coat is in scent color. It does come with a belt. Uh, since it's black, I have styled it with a black leather shorts as well as Chanel combat boots for more street style look. I had added Chanel classic in black color. This super casual look is from Pangaya. The tracksuit is in size XS and it is in this beautiful Sakura pink color. I have styled it with Louis Vuitton sneakers. Another super cozy tracksuit is from Love Sec Fancy. It is in size small. To style this uh, track suit uh, for going out, I have styled it with Louis Vuitton timeout sneakers with Balenciaga denim jacket as well as Chanel mini coco handle in pink color. The track pants can be also styled with this jumper from Lovesack Fancy in size small. As you can see, it can be worn off shoulder and since it is uh, longer, it's a little bit more suitable for cooler days. Ola Johnson boots have been purchased to match this article blazer in khaki color. Here is the close-up look. Uh, they are in size 38, so I had to size half a size up and they are really comfortable. 
So guys, that's it from today's haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you've got any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would really love you to join my YouTube family and catch up with you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and have a lovely day, guys. Take care of yourself. Ciao.